<laughs> Here's your change, Erin. God, your eyeballs must be so tired. Nestled on the corner of Elston and Hamlin Avenue sits a colorful creation, the Sugar Hole. Josh Deal and his wife, Abby, co-own the Color Club, a venue for creative expression. They were looking to add something new to the venue. Rundown podcast host Aaron Allen finds out more. Thank you. We have a two-year-old, and there's just like a fair amount of puppets strewn about the house. For whatever reason, they're just part of how toddlers like to play. And so one day at dinner, we were talking about like, oh, well, the sugar hole should like, what if it was a little puppet hand that came out and took your change or took your money when you paid? And then my wife, Abby, was like, oh, well, maybe just puppets should work there. And it's like, oh, my God, you're right. The ice cream spot has gone viral for its puppet yeah. servers. Wait, you can see my sweat? And its creative take on ice cream. My main character's name is Puddles. Uh, he is chronically congested. My background is in education. I teach K through eighth grade at a Montessori school here in Chicago. And I use puppets mainly in the classroom. And uh, they, I find they really help kids with emotional literacy. Um, and to help them feel more comfortable with whatever concept I'm teaching. I, I usually use my bear puppet, Aurora Borealis. She's a polar bear that is just hyper-realistic. My main thing is making hyper-realistic animals, and uh, it's always been like my goal in life to make hyper-realistic stuffed animals, and puppetry became a really good outlet for that. So, yeah, she was my first puppet that I ever made, actually. <laughs> the pop-up puts a smile on both the customers and the employees' faces. I got to know the owner, Abby and Josh, and just sort of like wanted to help out because I love it. Connecting with people and, and that, that sense of disbelief they have when they come up and like they, they truly are like treating this puppet as a complete being. And that, that's the most magical part. The Sugar Hole will be open from 3 to 8 p.m. every weekend until Labor Day. Sandra Salib, WBEZ.